Hey everyone, so before the video starts, this video is actually sponsored. Uh, before the video starts, if you guys want to go ahead and go to the actual video, the timestamp um, on the screen is where you guys can go to the actual video. But for those who want to keep listening to the sponsor of today's video, keep listening. So the sponsor of today's video is a game which was released recently, but has been managed to be loved by many, and it's called the Rumble Blast. So the idea itself is not new, it's a simple genre, originated back in the 90s. However, the developers decide that new is well forgotten old and game new life to the familiar concept on one hand the gameplay is unpretentious and simple but only at a superficial glance in fact the game challenges you from almost from the first level when um, you're not able to collect a couple of cubes of the same color and undermine them but you need to build a whole strategy for them you need to build a whole strategy otherwise the levels will not pass features are a huge number of levels with a variety of puzzles a personal squad team with charismatic character figures unique amplifiers to increase the power of explosions after half an hour of playing i realized that this is not a simple game but a game that challenges the player and rewarding you for diligence at the same time thus the old idea is presented with a new look and it turned out to be very beautiful and exciting the link to uh, the game is in the description down below. I recommend giving it a try. I've already played a lot of it and it's insanely fun. Let's get straight into the video. Hey everyone, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can make your edits 10 times faster than they already are so basically as you guys know boys i am a fast editor on mobile boys and the main question that i always get right now and in this wall main question i always get is how are your edits so fast and how can i make my edits as fast as yours so the main thing i want to talk about today is the, there's actually two things i want to talk about today so one is having a hud that is set up for editing and the other is the fast reset that i made a video on a few months ago um and i'm gonna show you guys this today so we're gonna start with the edit reset which is actually the main thing that makes my edits super super fast so basically what you guys want to do is set up your hud like this boys and basically have a edit as here and then have the edit toggle and reset right there so basically when you click those two buttons at the same time uh like simon taylor so if you guys click these two buttons edit toggle and reset and edit at the same time you guys will get an instant reset i'm just going to discard these changes so basically if i edit this and then i click these two buttons at the same time it insta resets like scroll wheel resets but on mobile and one thing that people are saying okay so i can do that and you might be saying well, how is this different from your other video but basically what people say is that they they can do this really easily but they don't know how to do it like really fast over and over again and the main thing that you need to do is swipe your thumb in a uh, in a what's it called in a counterclockwise motion so when you do this or well it can be clockwise it can be counterclockwise but if you guys are editing this like right here boys you have to swipe your thumb really quickly in a counterclockwise motion right now my ping just got bad but if you just do it in a counterclockwise motion over and over again start slow go fast your edits will be 10 times faster from that so as you guys can see right now as you guys can see right now, I got the hand cam set up, and I'm going to show you guys how my thumb moves. Just keep your eye on my thumb. All right, boys, so that was the counterclockwise edit method uh, plus the, you know, <laughs> plus the reset method. But now I'm going to show you guys how you guys can edit super, super fast by having your HUD set up right. So the first thing you want to do is have six fingers on your device. Right now, I need you guys to start. And I'm, I know some people are saying, I don't want to switch. I don't want to switch to six fingers or I don't want to switch, you know, from two fingers, whatever. Switch to six fingers, chat. It's the easiest way to edit fast. And it's the only amount of fingers that you really need to edit fast. I mean, yeah, you can edit fast with four fingers, but it just doesn't have that much mobility on it. So main thing that I'm going to say right now is have two edit buttons like this right here. One edit button next to the other. And in my opinion, what's it called? Target edit and edit works best, but you guys can do either. And pretty much if you guys have these two edit buttons right next to each other, have some sort of edit buttons next to each other, you'll be able to click on them super, super fast, get that muscle memory down, and you'll be able to just edit 10 times faster than you normally would. So now that you've gotten both of those things set up, lastly, I want to show you guys how to actually implement them and get them to be fast. You want to start super, super slow. This is the main key. I started slow and now I'm fast. It takes like almost a month of practice if you guys really want to get fast. But if you just start slow like this, edit a wall, you know, just do this right now. 
and then you just start to edit faster and edit faster and edit faster and then eventually you'll be able to edit as fast as me if not faster um, because I don't really practice this game that much, but yeah, pretty much boys if you get it like this And then you'll be able to you should be able to get to this speed um, By at least two but yeah, boys, that was pretty much the tutorial, boys. Hopefully, you guys all enjoyed. Um, if you guys did, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. Uh, I know I haven't been uploading that much, but we're going to get back on the grind as usual. And yeah, boys, like I said in the beginning of the video, this video was sponsored. Uh, link in the description down below. And yeah, thank you guys all for watching the video, boys. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow or whenever I upload next.